What's going on everybody? So I'm about to show you really quickly how close I'm still to getting this 93 overall Mike Vick. Obviously a 94 when you uh you know use the chems. Bruh, I cannot get this 91 overall Mike Vick. I want to know who which one of you guys pulled it. I looked on Mudhead, I only saw like six of them, and they were selling for wild amounts, bro. So it doesn't even really matter to me, bro. We we tried to try out some of this uh my 91 overall Mike Vick, he's actually the 90, but he's actually uh, with the chems 91. Just like everything goes up plus one, depending on what kind of chems you're using. The one that I have is actually the um, Philadelphia Eagles one. I don't know if you guys remember when he was an Eagle, bro. That one game he had with like seven touchdowns and all kind of craziness. It was pretty wild, man. It was pretty wild. He was fresh out of the pen. And uh, what? OBJ. Yo, what? what? What's this about? But it got me to thinking, if you're an Atlanta Falcons fan, and this is for only Atlanta Falcons fans, right? Which quarterback would you rather have? Matty Dry Ice right now or Mike Vick in his prime? And I was really thinking about that because you know the one thing, I remember Mike Vick that one year before he went to jail, right? He had that, um, I think he beat the Packers. I think they were the first team to actually go to Lambeau and beat the Packers, if I'm not mistaken. It was something like that. But he went out there and took care of business. Obviously, he lost in the next thing. He never, he never went to the Super Bowl. But it was obvious where they were headed before that whole... Um, you know, conspiracy happened and he was incarcerated. But I really want to know because this man had, you know, rides named after him at, at, at amusement parks, you know, the Michael Vick experience. It was really, really wild. This guy was so electrifying. And even in this game right here, that's why I started thinking about it because I'm playing against Matt Ryan. Matt Ryan, I don't, the thing, I think he had his chance to overtake Mike Vick last year and the Patriots ruined it. You know what I'm saying? Like, the more I think about because I went, look, let me just tell you this right now. I was about to doze off because, you know, obviously the foul. Oh, pick that. Ew, that. That's hot hands right there. That's hot. Bro, Julius Peppers. I don't know. Why would you try him, though? Why would you try Julius Peppers? That's what I, bro, the dude is 6'7", running around like a straight freak. And you're going to really try to do that, man? Yo, this OBJ right here is straight OP. I'm about, I'm, I'm so close to completing mine. Um, I just got to finish up a couple more team leader games and then I'm going to give you some uh, OBJ gameplay. Let me know in the comment section if you want that OBJ gameplay immediately. Or you could wait on it. I got to know what I'm dealing with. Like, do you want it right now? Like, now? Like, do I need to grind out? I think I got, like, nine or ten more solos to do, and then I got OBJ. Do you need that right now or right now? You know what I'm talking about? Like, you could... What the... Julius Peppers, you garbage, bro. Like, I was just praising you, but now you garbage. But let's get back to this whole Mike Vick and Matt Ryan thing, right? So, we know that Matt Ryan, as a passer, I would say... Why did he just do, uh... Like, he's trying to truck somebody, and then... Okay. I'm not going to pay attention to that. All right, so look. Let's put it like this, right? This Mike Vick is such a goon, bro. He's going to fumble the ball and then recover his own fumble. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up right there. Yeah, yeah he's such a goon. Um, Matt Ryan, in my opinion, he's a better passer, all right? When I say better passer, obviously he doesn't have the arm strength that Michael Vick has, but he's more accurate. Deep balls and everything like that. Look, I see Mike Vick throw the ball 90 yards standing stationary, bro, without moving. Like, I literally seen him do that. Like, this dude, he was one of the most electrifying athletes of our time. But still, though, I don't know if Matty Dry Ice, you see, yo, the pa you got to pa blame the Patriots. It's sort of like how Tom Brady probably feels about Eli Manning. You know, he has to hate Eli Manning just for the simple fact that he knows he's a bum, but he beat him twice. That's how Matty Ice has to feel about, you know, I, I, I believe Mike Vick. Because Mike Vick's name is still, they got a new stadium and people still talk about Mike Vick. And... He's more of a draw, regardless. It, nobody's going to go crazy if you like, oh, pick that shit. Run up a six. Run up a six, two. Run up a six. Nobody's going to go crazy ever in Madden and they release like a vintage legend, Matt Ryan. They're like, okay, he's a legend and, you know what I'm saying? But Mike Vick is releasing. Everybody's going crazy. Like, I'm literally trying to contemplate, should I, you know, like, stop paying certain bills to keep pulling cards? No, I want to pull packs, bro. Like, I need to pull packs. You guys, you know what I'm talking about? Like, I need to do it. I know it's wrong, but I don't want to be right. You guys know what I'm talking about? Like, it's no way possible I'm probably going to get that 91 overall Vic, but I got to believe that I can. And that's the thing about it. Like, when you believe in yourself, like, I already know if I don't pay the light bill, it's probably going to be bad for, like, a couple of days, and then we'll get used to it, go back to the olden days, get some coals. Like, I don't know what we got to do, but that's what I'm saying. That's the difference. You're not going to get a weekend, weekend out of this for any Matt Ryan card ever. So does that justify? Did he just pick me? Hold on, wait a minute. Yo, did he just throw a Stevie? Well, let's do it. What's the end of the half anyway? I think it's the end of the half, right? Second quarter. Yo, we about, to, we about to lock up right here. I don't think he's going to be able to do nothing. He's going to be able to do something right here? Yo, yo, get... Oh, all right. 
Yeah, I thought that Chantel was going to get there. He couldn't get there, though. All right, throw me to Stevie right quick. All right, he didn't do it. All right, but that's what I'm saying. So, pretty much, I just wanted to go to that consensus because I know it's going to be a lot of people that's going to be like, yeah, bro, yo, Matt, Matt Ryan this, Matt Ryan that, his stats, all that kind of stuff like that. I'm talking about impact. Which quarterback would you rather have? And you know what? Let's open it up to all NFL fans because the Atlanta Falcons fans are probably going to be, you know, I don't know, man, because they did, like, shut up about it. Make a choice. Who would you rather have? Any NFL fan of any team. Because Michael Vick, what, who's he throwing to? Okay, yeah, he's garbage. Which Mike Vick is this? What throw was that? I don't even know what that was. How did he not throw that dot, though? Yo, bro, what the F? Yo, hold on, wait a minute. Did he just really throw that ball nowhere near what's going on? I don't know what this is right here, but this guy's obviously running um, cover for a drop show, too. So that it's automatic lockup, dog. Even though, okay, throw the dot. Throw the dot right here. Yeah, yeah, do the animation where the ball pops out. All right, cool. So... The issue that I'm having right now is this, right? What the, the more that I talk about it and I'm hearing myself say Mike Vick and Matt Ryan, it doesn't make any sense for them to be mentioned in the same breath. Even though Matt Ryan is probably going to end off with the better career, I don't think the Atlanta Falcons will ever be that same environment without Michael Vick there. You guys know what I'm... Like, you know, like his whole... Talk about losing your career in a matter of seconds. Pick that! Run up a, it's just so crazy how you can have the world in the palm of your hands, and then you just start doing some wild things, and people are like, all right, you done, bro. And then it's, you know what I'm saying? But then he comes out of jail and gets another $100 million contract. Like, I really just don't think that a lot of people can do that. You know what I'm saying? That, that, should, tell, that should tell us, an, oh, we're just getting real sticky out here. That should tell us enough of, you know, the reason behind why Mike Vick is probably the better quarterback. You know what I'm saying? Because it just doesn't make any sense in any other aspect to think about it. Like, what, what else can we say about that? What, what else can we actually say? To, act, to, to give Matt Ryan a shot to even be in the ballpark of a Michael Vick. I, I don't know, guys. And I'm really concerned to, to see these comments because I know that it's going to be a couple guys going to be like, yo, bro, this, that, this, that. I don't know, man. I really, I, I, really, I, I don't know. Because I'm taking Mike Vick all day. Even though the guy was, yo, bro, the dude was overthrowing like almost everybody throwing the ball into the stand sometimes. That he was going to make, he was a winner. Pretty much what he was. And if he would have if he would have played the next season after all that stuff that happened when he won in Green Bay and they came back, it listen, he, they would have definitely went to the Super Bowl. And I don't know what would have happened, but it would have changed the history of a lot of players in the league if Mike Vick never went to prison for that time. So that's just what I wanted to get out now that I was you know playing against a dude in Atlanta and, I, and this whole Mike Vick craziness is going on right now. I just wanted to you know start that conversation up and see what you guys and girls are thinking. All right, now back to this game right here. This dude right here, right? He's a bum. But he's that kind of bum that he's very consistent with his bumality. And what I mean by his bumality is this. He's going to come out and run cover for a drop, show two, and he doesn't care what's going on. He doesn't care if it's a, you know, the Walking Dead is out there, it's an apocalypse. The dude's going to run that play. And it's very disgusting, but it was really ill, though, because I actually figured out how to make sure that I never have issues with it for the rest of the year. Because even if they patch the game and try to do something wild... I figured out exactly why the defense is so um, consistently dominant. And now that I know that, I'm looking for dudes to come out running cover for a drop, show two, and all kind of craziness. Because it, it, it's on and popping now. Now is the time where I'm going to show you guys. Listen, dudes are getting dots for days. And I'm going to keep this Michael Vick. Um, I'm going to probably see what I can do with Ben Roethlisberger. But if you guys want to be – I know somebody's going to ask me that. You know, you have Big Ben. Why, uh, what do you think? you going to keep that Mike Vick? I'm going to keep that Mike Vick until I can possibly get to 93. But I will tell you this. He is better than uh, the Ben Roethlisberger. Even though he's lacking in a little bit of um, accuracy with, like, the short throw, I think by, like, plus two or plus three, everything else. And plus, if I continue to upgrade his throw power, I can get him to a 91 throw power if I, if I max him out with throw deep. So I'm probably going to keep the Mike Vick. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, I don't know where I'm going with it. I don't know exactly... Because if, if he's only going to be a 91, it's going gonna, it's gonna to kind of hurt my score. I, I don't know, bro. I got to figure out how to get that 91. And I don't know if EA is going to extend it. You know what I'm saying? Because nobody realistically pulled that 91 uh, Vic. I don't know what was going on. I was I literally stalked the auction house. And, you know, one will be up and it'll be gone. One will be up, then it'll be gone. It was really, really crazy. Plus, I'm not spending 75 million coins on it. You know what I'm saying? I'm not doing that. Because what's going to happen is... I don't know any other quarterback that they're going to release for the rest of the year other than another Mike Vick, possibly an ultimate ticket Mike Vick that's going to be, you know, more electrifying 
than Mike Vick at quarterback. There really is no other quarterback that people are going to go crazy about with that speed and the combination of throw power for the rest of the year. So it seems kind of weird that they would release it this early. You know what I'm saying? Because now it's like, where do you go from here? If Mike Vick is already out, I think this was kind of crazy, but it doesn't really matter what I think. The whole thing is, I'm probably going to keep this Mike Vick and try to get the 91, maybe get a snipe somehow, some way. I got I to gotta complete it because I don't see why I would get rid of this quarterback because this dude, Mike Vick, throws hot ones. And when I say hot ones, he's throwing straight fireball flames. So he fits my scheme perfectly. There really is no reason to do anything else other than keep him at this point. So that's probably where I'm going to be with it. Um, but I was thinking about trying to get an Aaron Rodgers, something like that. But I'm like, nah, because Aaron Rodgers, it don't really, you know, he don't got the throw power that Vic got at the base. He got an 88 throw power. You know, Vic starting with a base at 89 with the 91 overall that I got now. And like I told you, he can go to, um, you know, the 91 throw power. Also, if you just max out the go deep chem. So more than likely, I'm going to stay with this Mike Vick. Uh, in conclusion, I'm definitely taking Mike Vick for mines. If you guys go Matt Ryan, let me know why in the comments, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just don't see how you can actually do that um, in any case for what Mike Vick. Okay, just throw this pick right quick. Oh, oh, that was me throwing the ball. Oh, yeah, we just throw hot ones. Bro, we just, we, bro, pitch and catch. Yeah, this dude right here about to rage quit. So I'm going to see you guys and girls next time, man. Much love. Subscribe. Share. One love.